with M. Mars. Correct. Well, I spy with my big eye something beginning with E. Earth. No, the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> Well, I spy with my massive eye something beginning with D. Uh, uh, Denmark? Uh, Dublin? Uh, uh, Down Beetle? Danny's house, nah! Ooh. Hi, my name's Danny and this is my fantastic name. Best friend, Jacques. Yeah, but, oh, where was I? Your name's Danny and I'm the best friend too, Sam. As I was saying, this is my fantastic new Max! I'm a brother and actually it's Ben. What? Oh, it's our show. Can you just repeat? As I was saying, my name's Danny and this is my fantastic. What did I tell you? I give up. Things are looking up, people. I've had six auditions in the last week. My big break must be just around the corner. Uh hey! I've had to keep blowing out Sam and Jack at the last minute. They're my friends. They'll understand. Danny at home. Shocker. So, are you going to blow us out now or later? Oops. Guys! We know these auditions are important. Yeah, but we really miss seeing our friend. <laughs> but I miss seeing you. All work and no play makes Danny a very dull friend. Oh, let's go out tonight. Sam and Jack. See? Booked. I'm all yours. And this time you promise not to blow us out? Not for anything in the world. I can't believe you fixed your car. It was crushed by a giant girl. Ben, there's nothing you can't make with a little sticky tape and a whole load of genius. What about a rocket? Only a fool makes his own fireworks. Ben, what have you done? <laughs> they said in the news this morning, there's a competition to find the first amateur rocket builder who can make it into space. Really? Yeah. You watch the news? Max, you should enter the competition. Ben, there's no way I'm building a rocket. The prize is a million pounds. Let's get to work. Yes. I've blacked some tickets to that new club, Apollo. I heard it's full of posers and wannabes. Me too. I'm so excited. I might try and scam a guest spot on the decks. It's from my agent. Jess and Kelly are forming a new group, Cat Attack. Do I want to audition? Yeah, I want to be in Cat Attack. So, if I got into the group, would I have to dress like that? You don't like our new look. Oh, yeah, it's great. I just uh, didn't realise that Cat Attack would really be, you know, cats. You're not allergic to cats, are you? Because that could be a problem. No, I'm not allergic. Can we see your cat face? My cat face. I don't think you're the cat we're looking for. Maybe you're more of a dog person. You are the cat that gets the cream. Thanks. <laughs> She's biking over the music and lyrics to their songs. The audition's tonight. I can't go, can I? Because I promised you guys I wouldn't blow you out. You're going to keep your promise? Yeah, unless you think I shouldn't miss this once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. She's coming with us. <laughs> well, I... It's going to be a great night. But it might be better for my career if I... See you <laughs> No. <sighs> this is the sort of rocket that will launch me into space and make me a millionaire. Isn't it a bit small? How are you going to fit inside? I'll be using my shrink ray. Cool. It's a scale model, Ben. It's to test if the design works. Oh. And the shrink ray? Doesn't exist. I knew that. I'll climb into my rocket here. Why can't I be the astronaut? Because you're mission control. You start the countdown. But mission control's boring. I want to be a spaceman. You get to press the big red button. <laughs> Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, blast off! Is it in space now? No, it's in pieces. <laughs> oh, the 
music and lyrics on my agent. <sighs> Pen doesn't work. It's a sign I shouldn't sign. I can't blow my friends out. Wait. I'll get another pen. <laughs> having a bad day? If I'm having a great day, it's tonight that's bad. Unless you know how I can be in two places at the same time. <laughs> Whoa. It's like looking in a mirror that turns your hair blonde. I read somewhere that everyone in the world has a double, but odds are they never get to me. Hi, I'm Danny. Maggie. Wait a second. I can't be in two places at the same time. You could be me. I'm sorry. I need you to do the most humongous favour in the entire world. Look, I found your head. You know, Ben, I've been thinking. You would make much a better astronaut than me. Really? I don't have a head for heights. I'm going to find the rocket. Just need to fix a small design flaw first, but then you're good to go. Max, you're the best friend ever. Let the astronaut training begin. You want to pay me to go out with your friends and pretend to be you so you can go to an audition? Yeah. <laughs> OK, what about my hair? How would you feel about dyeing it? No way. I'll pay you extra. OK. Max, why am I wearing this? It's a pretend pretend spacesuit. Pretend? It'd be perfect if you get into any pretend trouble. And it's going cheap because it's got a lot of wear and tear. Lean against the washing machine. When the rocket starts up, you'll be shaken around like a rag doll. You've got to learn how to cope with the vibration. My hikes. This is making me feel sick. Firing main engine. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you look different. I do. Yeah, I thought that too. You did. Yeah, something about you's changed. OK, look, I thought this was going to work, but that's it. The jacket. It's new, isn't it? And it totally works. You look great. Ah, oh, thanks. Come on, let's not waste time, people. There's a dance floor out there with our names on it. Come on. They totally thought Maggie was me. Cat attack, here I come. I hope Maggie doesn't embarrass me on the dance floor. <laughs> Did you have to come dressed like a chicken? Everybody's staring at us. I know, works every time. <laughs> My audition went amazing last night. I made the shortlist, and they want to see me again today. Hi. You've got some explaining to do. Listen, guys, I'm so sorry if I embarrassed you. I can explain. I think you ought to. Last night, you were a completely different person. I don't know why I used a double. I am in so much trouble. We had no idea you could... Be so funny. Sorry? Where did all those jokes come from? <laughs> jokes. Oh, yeah, the jokes. Yeah, I think they were good, weren't they? They were hilarious. I laughed so hard, I think I split a rib. <laughs> <gasps> Tell us another one. Another one? You want another one of my hilarious jokes? Well, uh, oh, 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 I've got one. Why did the chicken cross the road? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Why did the chicken cross the road? To get to the other side! <laughs> That's really old. So not funny. Yeah, well, sorry, I can't be funny all the time. Shame. You are on a roll last night. Mm. So, you excited about our shopping trip? <laughs> She's excited. <laughs> this spacesuit is awesome. I should keep you airtight. If you spring a leak in space, patch it pronto. What happens if I run out of oxygen? Hold your breath till re-entry. Put this on. Can you hear me OK? Right, now, practice moving around. Oh, what, what are you doing? 
What do you say, Max? I said, watch what you do. <laughs> Max, where are you? Stop knocking where? me down! Oh. <laughs> Help! Don't panic, I've got you. <laughs> I thought you'd want to go shopping. I'm going back for a second audition today. Don't blame me. It was your friend's idea. I'll just tell them I've got an audition and that they'll have to go without me. They said if I blow them out, they'll never speak to me again. Oh, come on, give me a break. Look, I've got to run. Wait, you can cover for me. I'm sorry, Danny. I'd love to help, but I've got my own life to live. I'll pay you double. <laughs> Plus, I'll need shopping money. That's all I've got. 43 pence, a used bus ticket and a button. I'm broke and desperate. And it's a really nice button. <laughs> Go on, then. But I'll need some of your clothes. Wardrobe's upstairs. Help yourself. Say hello to Max's moon machine. Shouldn't it be called Ben's moon machine? I am the astronaut. My design, my rocket, my million pounds. You mean our million pounds? That's what I said. <laughs> it's our washing machine. It is one of the many household items we have to scavenge to build this bad boy. <laughs> TV, vacuum cleaner, microwave, lawnmower, shed roof, springs from Danny's bed, a washing machine, fridge You're door... You're building a rocket? Uh-oh. Busted. You know, this might actually work. And you're OK with us taking these things to build this rocket? Go for it. Your sister's way cooler than we thought. I can't wait for Earthling Ben to arrive. I've prepared a traditional welcome feast. For starters, we've got slime soup. Uh, tasty. And then for mains, we've got wriggle beans. Mm, delicious. And then we'll wash that down with a glass of freshly squeezed tentacle juice. Mm, cheesy. And then, to finish, we've got a sweet slice of earwax cake. Who ate the cake? Not me. Hat ham. Hat ham. <laughs> and the rest. Now, please don't eat the cake. I'm saving it for Ben. I'm sorry to all night to talk. I couldn't help myself. It's just so tasty. <sighs> OK, people, let's shop till we drop. They better not have a good time with me. I mean, with, is it... Oh, you understand. I can't believe it. They loved my singing. I'm down to the final five. And I'm going back tonight for a final audition for Cat Attack. <laughs> Where's the fridge? <laughs> and the washing machine. And... <gasps> We've been burgled! There's no sign of a break-in. I must have picked the lock. OK, thank you, officer. There you are! Oh, man, we were so worried about you. You were? Well, I can't believe you got arrested. What were you thinking, dancing in the shopping centre fountain? I did what? <laughs> <laughs> I mean... Sorry, I've uh, just got to make a very urgent phone call. Back in a sec. This is one small step for Ben. One giant leap for Ben Kind. <laughs> Hammer that onto there. Roger that, Mission Control. And make my way up the outside of the rocket. I will now attempt to attach the cog thing to the outside thing. Just get on with it. Ah. <laughs> 
Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> Quick, in here. I was arrested. Sorry, just got carried away. To the police station. Relax. <laughs> I was only given a warning for dancing in the fountain. Oh, well, that's OK, then. At least I know I'm not going to prison. Danny? Um, who are you talking to? No one. I was just doing my vocal exercises. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti. We're going to the movies tonight. Do you want to come? But no dancing in the aisles. I've got an audition. Uh, no worries. We'll see you tomorrow. Well, good luck tonight. Break a leg, but don't. I could double for you at the movies tonight, if you like. I really don't mind. But I do. Who knows what I'll be arrested for next time? Robbing a bank, stealing a car, streaking through the centre of town? <laughs> Your services are no longer required. Now, please leave. We did it, Max. We did it. OK, you did it. <laughs> and I watched from the corner where I couldn't break anything. Tomorrow, you're going to boldly go where no boy has gone before. The girls' toilets? To the stars, Ben. The stars! <laughs> you want me to meow and not sing? Hmm, you'll soon get the hang of it. It's easy, you just go like this. Meow. Yum, 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 meow. Meow. Yum, 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 meow. Meow. Yum, 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 meow. <laughs> Don't you think people are going to find this a little bit weird? Well, of course people are going to think it's weird, but cats are going to love it. What? <laughs> <laughs> Morning, world. Bad news. I think I blew my final audition. <sighs> Morning, sleepyhead. Oh, she's having a PJ day. That's OK. Oh, here. I owe you for my ticket. What ticket? Last night at the movies. You paid for my ticket, remember? No, I was at my audition. No, silly. The audition was cancelled, so you came out with us. <laughs> I can't have. I was... <laughs> oh, no. Just gonna uh, make a quick phone call. Again. Uh, I won't be a minute. She's been making a lot of urgent phone calls recently. Mr. Table. <laughs> Ready for systems check. Ready. Navigation. Check. Life support. Check. Telecommunications. Check. Main engines. Check. Increase thrust from woolens to acrylics. Increase thrust to mixed fabrics. What's the opposite of check? <laughs> Solenoid's blown. We're gonna have to find a replacement. I'll go and stand in the corner. <laughs> this has got to stop. They're my friends, not yours. Yeah, well, now they're my friends too. They're only friends with you because they thought you were me. Yeah, well, if it wasn't for me, they wouldn't be friends with you anymore. Especially if they find out you've been blowing them out all this time. Oh, so it's blackmail, is it? You want me to pay you not to say anything? No, I just want to share Sam and Jack. How about you get them during the week and I get them at weekends? This is crazy. They're my friends. Get your own friends. I like yours better. Tough. <laughs> get out and stay out. On second thoughts, hide. <sighs> Hello, uh, you reported a burglary. Oh, yeah, come in. So, that's the stereo from the living room, and as you can see, they've taken almost everything in the kitchen, apart from the microwave. And you say there's no sign of a break-in? No, I just came in and everything was gone. I think I might have found your burglars. Max, what are you doing? You know these young gentlemen? Yeah, this is my brother and his friend. Why are you wearing a spacesuit? Did you take those other appliances? Yes, Danny said we could take them. <laughs> I said no such thing. 
It's a serious offence to waste police time. Just a second, aren't you the girl I caught dancing in the fountain? Oh, I can explain. Well, let's do that explaining down at the station, shall we? No! Wait, you've got the wrong girl! Maggie! Help! Coming, Danny! Hi, Sam. Do you and Jack want to come over and hang out? Cool. Laters. Have you got another microwave? No, I haven't got another microwave. Just asking. <sighs> Look, Ben, I'm sorry. It's just, it's so frustrating. I can't work out what's wrong. Sounds like you're overloading the flange controller. <laughs> Do you want me to give it a tweak? <laughs> what is it with you? One minute you're reporting us to the police as burglars, the next you're an expert on engines. I know. <laughs> what am I like? I've been in that police station. Three hours! Let's just hope I never see Meddling Maggie ever again. Fresh popcorn coming right up. Danny's in great form, isn't she? She's taken over my life. OK, Meddling Maggie, it's time for you to leave or else. Or else what? You go in there and tell Sam and Jack the truth. You know I can't do that. Oh, this is so unfair. You wanted me to be you. I just like the job so much, I decided to make it permanent. Oh, yeah? Well, we'll see about that. <laughs> Hi, guys. Here's your popcorn. You changed your clothes? <laughs> yeah, fancy to change. <sighs> Fast dresser. <laughs> <laughs> Frick! How did you do that? I'm Danny's double. The real Danny's hiding behind the sofa. <laughs> <laughs> you cracked me up. It's a good one. <laughs> what? What movie are we having? We've got action, comedy, romance. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with a good love story. Hey, no chick flicks. Danny, what do you think? Action sounds good. Oh, thank you. Hey, Danny, could you give the flange controller another tweak before we launch? What? Mm, tweak away. We're in no hurry. It's a rocket! Why are you saying that like you've never seen it before? Uh, well, last time I didn't really look at it properly. <laughs> Is that part of the washing machine? Oh, I didn't see that before, either. <laughs> Here's your spanner. I'll just be in the corner if you need me. Right. Just a little tweak should do it. Right, I'll, uh, tweak away. <laughs> there we go. All done. There you go. You're not really going to fly this thing, are you? No, Ben is. Oh, that's okay then. <laughs> oh. All sorted? I think so. Mm. Lights, camera. No, 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 wait, 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 no, I really need to wait. No, 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 wait, don't wait. Last off! Help me! Last off! Weird. 
Looks like the washing machine leaked. I have a confession to make. I've been using a double so I could go to auditions. You did what? I didn't want to keep blowing you out, so I hired someone to go in my place. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so that's why your clothes kept changing? OK, I'm confused. Which one is Danny? I'm Danny. No, well, I'm Danny. No, I'm Danny. No, I'm Danny! That's Danny. Of course it is. Hello, well, I'm here. I think it's time you left. No! Wait, this is my house! Can you believe this girl? What are you doing to Danny? How do you know this is Danny? Because she's the one who wrecked our rocket. She's the one who knows about engines. Look at her hands. OK, you got me. I'm Maggie, she's Danny. Not a bad performance, though, I think you'll agree. I might try going on a few auditions. Who knows? Might even be me who gets in the girl band. You know, I had a sneaky suspicion... You were just about to throw me out. Yeah, sorry about that. No, I'm the one that should be apologising. I can't believe you hired a double to hang out with us. I'm so sorry, guys. That's so sweet. Yeah, you wanted to make us happy. That's solid. <laughs> well, it was all for nothing. I didn't even get into that group. Yes, you did. I gave you the message, remember? What message? A girl called Jess rang to say you were hired. You were really excited when I told you. Maggie. She's going to try and take your place. Oh, do you know what? She's welcome to it. Besides, I'd much rather be here with my friends. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was so looking forward to meeting an Earthling. Hey, so what if his spaceship doesn't work? Let's beam Ben aboard anyway. <laughs> We are banned from abducting the Earthlings. Don't be such a small sport. Welcome to space. Ah! <laughs> Noisy little creatures, aren't they? <laughs> Thank you.